welcome everybody. Happy greetings. My name is Tessa and we are going to do some dancer size kids. Now, I don't know if it's raining at your house, but it's sure raining at my house outside. So I thought we would have a little adventure inside and do a few songs that have to do with springtime and the rain and the water. Well, my friends, I'm going to set my umbrella down right here. And we are going to talk about our three rules of class before we get started. Let's remind ourselves the first rule is to be a good listener. Our second rule is to try your best. And our third rule is to have fun. All right, my friends, if you're ready to have fun, I'm ready to have fun with you. I have had a lot of really awesome friends that have had their mom or dad reach out to me and let me know the fun things that you're doing. So far, no one has caught a leprechaun that I've heard of. We got super close the other day. So far, we don't have a final name for the kitty that Miss Jordan found. So if you have a good idea for this little cutie, go ahead and let us know. She's still trying to pick out a name for this little girl. And the other thing that I wanted to do is have our special time that's called Hello Friends, because a lot of you are sending in all the fun things that you're doing at home. So I wanted to say hello to Hazel and Zoe, and my friend Zeke, and my friends Theo and Enzo. I'd like to say hello to my friends Tanache and Maita. And then we also have some sisters that I've known for a long time. We have Amaya, Mia, and Macy dancing with us today too. I also had a really great idea that I wanted to share with you because Kirsten and Isabel's mom said that they made musical instruments at home. You may have seen our little craft activity, uh, activity video. So they made musical instruments at home and guess what they did? This is such a great idea. You could do this at your house. They had a first day of spring parade. I just think that's the greatest idea. So you know what? I was thinking we should do that to start off today's class. We should have a parade in honor of springtime and all of the rain that we're having. You may have noticed I also have on my rain boots and my raincoat, so I'm ready to go. Are you ready to go? If you need to grab your musical instruments, go ahead and grab them right now. It could be something that you've made or you could use something from your kitchen like wooden spoons or we had some friends that had a good idea. You could use a pan and a wooden spoon as your drum. You can use the wooden spoons or spatulas or chopsticks as your music sticks. Um, and we had some friends that made shakers out of their sippy cups where they just put some dried rice or dried popcorn into their sippy cup and they made their own shakers and maracas that way. Well, my friends, I'm going to use this one that we made in our craft. This was an empty water bottle, and I filled it with some dry rice and just made it really fancy the way I liked it with a lot of colors. And I'm going to use this shaker for our parade of music. So, my friends, let's go ahead and pretend that we are in our own parade. And the parade is to celebrate springtime and all of the raindrops that are coming down. Now, the other thing I was going to show you was the sign for rain. Let me just find our song on here. So the sign for rain is just if you show the raindrops sprinkling down just like that, the raindrops are going to sprinkle down. But if it's raining really hard, you can show that in your sign by showing the rain coming down hard like that. And if it turns to snow, you sprinkle the raindrops down and then you do the sign for cold. Shiver those arms in just like that. All right, my friends, we are ready to do our full parade of music. And I hope you can all join me with your musical instruments. 
because we're going to be our leader today. Strike up the band, pick up your feet. Our marching band will be coming down your streets. You'll hear the music, you'll hear now our let's songs. Now let's get those instruments, get your instruments so you can, can play along. along. Let's have them everyone's playing and running to the beat. Let's go high. And let's go way down low. Ready, go low. Who's going to find the part? Who's our leader today? All right, I can see you leading us. Let's see all the Let's see people who are tippy toes this time. Tippy toes, give them a wave. Hello, we're going to get our parade. You'll hear the bells. Oh, I heard the bells. Who had the bell in the tambourine? Was it you? I heard it. Here we go, ready? Let's march. And marching to the beat. Let's go high. Let's get those instruments. 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 Now hear the drums, they are the best. Let's keep on the drums today. There's no time to get ready. We're going to go down. We love to play. We hope our marching band brightens up your day. Everyone is playing and marching to the beat. Here we go. You know what? We're going to do a new one. We talked about this. We're going to turn. Can you walk and turn? Or can you keep going? share with you another song that has to do with the the rain. In fact, I'm going to teach you a new word because it's actually all about water. Can you show me the sign for water? Go oh, water, just like that. Now there's all kinds of fun things that we can do with the water. So let's see, can you think of something? What might we do with water if we're thirsty? You might have a drink of water. What if you wanted to get clean? You might take a bath. Can you show me thumbs up? And bring those in and go scrubby, scrubby. That's the sign for bath. So you might take a bath in the water. Then my favorite thing that I'm gonna do in a little bit, because there's lots of rain puddles outside, I'm gonna go and jump in the puddles. I'm gonna splish and I'm gonna splash and I'm gonna see how high I can make those puddles jump. That's going to be a fun way to exercise with my family and my doggies. It was Kaylee's birthday yesterday, and in another couple episodes, I'm going to introduce you to my dog, Coco. All right, my friends, this song is all about the water, and it's, I love the water, but guess what? I am going to teach you something that you can share with your family at dinner they're going to be so impressed at how smart you are because another name for water is h2 o should we sign that let's do that ready go h2 o that's another name for water and you know what a lot of kids don't even learn that until they're in high school so you guys are so super smart to know that all right so here's what we're going to do this is our tap dance, so I put on my tap shoes. You can pull your taps out of your magic pocket and put those onto your feet just like that. And we are going to do a few of our tap steps for this. So what we're going to do is we're going to start out, we're just going to go like this. We're going to go, oh, jump, jump, oh, jump, jump. We're jumping over the puddles, try not to get wet, ready, oh, jump, jump. And then we're going to tap our legs and go drip, drop, drip. Now we're gonna go the other way. Can you help me? How high can you jump when we do this? Ready? One, two, three. Oh, jump, jump. Here we go, do it again. Jump, jump. One more time. Oh, jump, jump. And then remember to shout out. What are we shouting? Let me hear you. Drip, drop, drip, okay? So now we're gonna go just like this. We're gonna clap our hands and then we're gonna do a shuffle with our foot. 
and it goes just like this. Shuffle, so you're going front, back, just like that. But we're gonna do it three times. So we're gonna go shuffle, shuffle, shuffle. Then we're gonna stomp, clap, drip, drop, drip. Now let's do the other side. Are you ready? We're gonna clap. Shuffle, 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 stomp, clap, drip, drop, drip. Now there's one more that I wanted to show you. We're gonna do swing to the side and you put your toe behind you. That's a little bit tricky. Sometimes your foot wants to go in front of you, but we're gonna try to do it behind you, if you can. If you do it in front, that's fine. As long as your feet are happy and as long as you're happy, then I'm happy. So here we go, ready? <gasps> swing, toe, swing, toe, just like that. Swing, toe, swing, toe. And then we're gonna do our shuffle step, jump, jump. <gasps> shuffle step, step. Remember we did that in Polly Parrot? Let's try that. Well, we'll see which one we can do. Let's try them both. Shuffle step, clap, Shuffle, hop, step, clap, clap, if we're getting super fancy. All right, now, where are my good singers? Are you guys good singers? Let me see who's out there. I can, I think I'm going to hear you guys singing. So we're going to sing this. I love the water, water, water. I love the water. Drip, drop, drip, just like that, okay? So when we hear the word H, to oh, we're gonna sign that. And when we hear bathtub, we're gonna do thumbs out, thumbs in, and scrubby, scrubby, just like that. Then in the middle, the rain is gonna come down. You guys know all these signs. You're so smart. And then we're gonna scrub up the town and make sure everything's nice and clean for everybody. All right, are you ready to help me sing and to help me dance? And we're gonna splash, splash, splash with the drip, drop, drip. I think that's my favorite part to say. It's just kind of fun to say. Did you say it with me? <gasps> drip, drop, drip, just like that. All right, my friends, here we go. We're gonna jump over those puddles. Can you jump over them? Jump really high so that you don't get wet. Do drip, drop, drip, now jump really high. Don't get wet in the puddles. Here we go. Jump, now shout it, say drip, drop, drip. Here we go. I love the water, water, water. I love the water. shoes and 
we're going to do a song. Do you remember how we did the scarecrow stretch? Do you remember what muscle that we worked on? Does anybody remember? It was the muscle, remember, between your elbow and the tickly part under your arm. It's this muscle right here is your, what is it? That's right, tricep. Good job, friends, tricep. Well, we went to Farmer Joe's Barn Dance, and you know he lives out on that farm, but you know what? What does he do on the farm? Do you know? Does anybody know what Farmer Joe is doing on his farm? Well, I'll tell you, he has a garden. And I'm going to take off my raincoat right now because I'm getting nice and warmed up with you guys. Um, this is how you sign garden. Can you hold the garden flat like that? And then just pretend like you picked up a flower and you go just like this. This means garden. So Farmer Joe has a garden and he grows all kinds of things in there. He grows flowers. And so if you were to pick a flower and smell it, that's the sign for flower. So show me flower. And then he also grows fruits. Can you show me if you picked up a fruit just like that? And you go like, like that, that's fruit. And guess what else he grows? He grows vegetables. Oh, can you show me this two fingers? This is vegetables, just like that. And he isn't even done there. He also plants trees. Can you put your arm down and plant a tree right there and show me it wiggling in the breeze, just like that? Pretty soon our trees are gonna have the buds on them, aren't they? Because we're in the springtime now. All right, my friends. So. Who can help me? What makes things grow? What do you think Farmer Joe does for his garden? Can you name a few things? Let's see. What might be bright and sunny in the sky? <laughs> the sunshine. Yeah, it's the sun. So here's what I want you to do. I want you to put your feet a little bit apart and we're going to do a great big sunshine and we're going to bring our arms from one side to the other because the sun is rising in the east and setting in the west and then it goes up and down and all the way around can you show me this it's gonna go all the way around just like that now what else are we gonna need to have everything grow do you know let's see we just did a whole song about our new word h2o it's the word Water, we need water, we need rain, right? Now, the flowers and fruits and vegetables and trees are gonna need that in just a little bit, but right now, we're gonna talk about sometimes when you have a storm like that, when you have rain that comes down, sometimes you might hear something that's a booming noise and it's thunder. Can you touch your ear that you're listening and go boom, 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 that's the thunder. And the thunder might go like this. Ready, set, boom! Can you help me with that? Ready, go. Ready, set, boom! Oh, you guys are good at that. Then you might see a flash that's really bright in the sky of lightning. And so we're going to make the lightning bolt. Can you help me? We're going to reach up high and we're just going to bring it like a zigzag. It goes, shh, 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 shh. And then it hits the ground like that. And then the thunder goes, boom! guys are good at this. Now, sometimes when there's a storm, the other thing that happens is there's lots of wind. Can you help me go whoosh, 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 and you may even go all the way around in a circle, whoosh, just like that. All right, my friends, we are ready to do our song about the raindrops, and we're going to make our garden at Farmer Joe's, so you guys can help me with that and help me with the signs. All right. Oh, I forgot to ask. You can pick out what do you want to be? Do you want to be a fruit? You could be like an apple tree, a cherry tree. Uh, oh, you might want to be a banana. I kind of want to be a banana. Or if you were a vegetable, you might be a carrot or you might be a potato. There are a lot of fun things that you could be. I'm not even sure. Oh, I know. I think I'm going to be maybe a cherry tree today. All right. So 
We're gonna start out a tiny little seed. Can you pull that out of your pocket? And here we do our raindrops dance. Here we go with Farmer Joe. Farmer Joe has a garden. Show me your garden with, with flowers, flowers and trees. Fruits and trees. This is, can you show me a story of how I came to be? Here's that seed, ready? When I was just a seed. He planted in the ground. Can you go down and dig it deep? Oh, dig, 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 dig. Now, let's put it into the hole and listen in for the raindrops. Oh, I think I hear them. Can you hear them? Can we tap with the raindrops? I hear it. They're going a little bit faster and a little bit faster. She's just kind of like a puppy, but she's super cute. You'll get to meet her pretty soon. All right, my friends, I am going to take off my ballet shoes, and I think we should do one more musical instrument song today because I know my friends did such a great job making those instruments that I would like to be able to use them for one more song. I am going to put on my pirate hat. Ahoy, mateys! Who says that? Do you remember who says, Ahoy, mateys! And away we go! Yeah, that's Captain... What's this? Who remembers this sign? <laughs> it's Captain Bubblegum. And what is it that he is in charge of? Do you remember? What's this? What is this? Do you remember? It's a boat. It's a ship. And it's the Goody Goody Gumdrop Pirate Ship. So, my friends, I'm going to grab my jazz shoes and let's see which instrument should I use for this time let's see I was able to use my maracas for that last one let's see I think did I use my music sticks last time with the with the licorice sticks maybe I'll do that one I'm feeling like those are pretty fancy all right my friends you pick whatever your favorite instrument is these are the ones that we made the other day with my heart and star and my giggle bean clown face. And then this one just has like sparkly fancy tape on it. All right, my friends. So do you remember our steps just really quickly? Remember Captain Bubblegum, he gets gum on his foot so he's gonna kick it off just like that. So he's gonna kick that gum off and he's gonna kick that gum off and do a big jump, jump. Who's jumping the highest today? Let me see, ready? Jump, jump, woo, you guys are good. Don't bump your head on the ceiling. All right, my friends, now remember, we're gonna 
shake up high to the sky with your licorice sticks and licorice sticks, sticks tap on the ground. And then you're gonna bang your cookie jars to the beat. Remember your drum is your cookie jar. And then you're gonna shake your jelly beans. The jelly beans are your maracas that you made. All right, are you kids ready? Here we go, we're gonna say, Ahoy mateys, and away we go. Here we go. Oh, Polly wanted to say hi today. Here she is. Hi Polly, can you say hi to everybody? Polly wants a cracker. <laughs> she always says, Dang it, lady. That's, that's Miss Polly. All right, Miss Polly, you can watch from right there, and we are going to do the goody goody gumdrop pirate ship. Here we go. Here we go. Let's get out those music sticks, your licorice sticks. Who's got the drums? Let me hear you beat the drums and shake the jelly beans. Here we go, ready? Sailing away. Where are we going? is shouting, ahoy mateys, and away we go! Jelly beans shake up and down, tap liquor sticks on the ground, bang cookie jars to the beat, everybody making music is so sweet, here we go! Jelly beans shake to the sky, tap liquor sticks up high, bang cookie jars to the beat, making music is so sweet, here we go! We're going to ice cream islands, my favorite! We like to dance our days away on the goody goody gumdrop pirate ship. Get your feet to the butterscotch. Oh my goodness, here we go. Captain Bubblegum is shouting, ahoy mateys, and away we go. Jelly beans shake up and down. Tap liquor sticks on the ground. Bang cookie jars to the beat. Making music is so sweet. Here we go. Shake to the sky. Aviana, and guess what? Their big brother, Aiden, is turning six years old. So everyone at the count of three will say, Happy birthday, Aiden. Are you ready? One, two, three. Happy birthday, Aiden. All right, I hope it's a great day. I hope it is a fantastic day for you and everybody. So I was going to tell you that I'm going to have another couple of craft activities that we can do. I have a song that's about a music. Do you remember the sign music? Because we're in our musical instruments unit. It's the music rainbow. Did you know a lot of times after the rain, when that sunshine comes out, you might see a rainbow. So we're going to do a song that's about the music rainbow and I have a fun craft activity where we can make a little rainbow wristband that we can use with that song. 
but we're gonna do that for next time so you'll, you can check that out. The other thing I wanted to tell you is I know a lot of us are in our houses and we might be looking for fun stuff to do. Is that you? I, I just, I never want to be bored. I always want to be doing fun stuff. So my friends, I have the greatest idea. We're going to have a dance party. We are going to have the most fun dance party. And we are going to do that coming up for the weekend. So if you are going to be home with your family and you want to have a fun dance party, you're going to come back and join me because I would love to see you. Now, my friends, thank you so much for joining me today. My name is Tessa. Look back for some of those fun craft videos. We'll have some Tessa time. And kids, this is really important. When you're here dancing with me and we're singing and exercising and having fun doing these things, that's a good time to let the grown-ups go do something. Maybe they need to do some work. Maybe they need to do some dishes or laundry or something like that. And maybe they just need a break and want to put their feet up. So you can have fun with me and let the grown-ups have a little bit of a break. Okay? All right. Now, I hope I see all of you at our dance party. You can wear whatever you would like. If you have something super fancy you want to wear, if you have a favorite pair of like cowboy boots or tap shoes or a favorite hat, like a pirate hat, you can wear whatever you want. And I know you friends at home have these dancer size kid shirts, so you should wear one of those too. I would love to see that. All right, now, before we go, do we do our three rules? Our first rule was be a good listener. We were, good job, give yourself a pat on the back. The second rule was to try your best. You did it, give your other shoulder a big pat. And the third rule is most important, have fun. I hope you guys have fun with me. And before we go, you know I always like to say, until next time, Heart and star.